Alrighties, welcome back to another episode of ASA, the series where I answer your questions. So leave a comment down below if you want to have your question answered in the next video. We only had three questions today, and our first one comes from Lieutenant Connick. He says, what is your favorite set that you don't own, and what is your favorite set that you do own? Um... Well, I'm going to start with one I do own. Uh, my favorite set that I do own at the moment is Kylo Ren Shuttle. It is just such a gorgeous ship. It is so beautiful. If you don't have it, I recommend you get it. It is just, it's amazing. Um, and to answer my favorite set that I don't own, I can't decide. I, there's like way too many Lego Star Wars sets that I don't own that I love so much. So I'm going to round it to any set that has Phase 2 clones and any set that has any Imperial Stormtrooper at all. Our next question comes from Salty Master. He has two questions, actually. Um, so I lied. I guess there's four questions, technically. Um, his first question is, do you think you will ever review any non-Lego Star Wars sets like Lego City? Um, I don't plan to. But maybe someday in the future, you see, I'm not made of money. I had to buy every single set. Like, like, um, I don't get any of these sets for free or anything, you know. So when I do a review on a set like Kylo Ren Shuttle, um, you know, I paid for that. Liar! Well, actually, that one was a gift. Darth Vader's castle, you know, I paid for that. So, like, it gets expensive. So, um, to do other themes... Maybe someday, but probably not right now. I would like to do City, actually, funnily enough. Um, that would probably be the only other theme I'm into. Maybe Technic. I've always thought that was kind of cool. I've never built a Technic set, though, um, besides Bionicle. I used to collect and build Bionicles. Um, so, I don't know. Someday, maybe, but it's entirely possible. I, I hate to be so like down, but it's entirely possible that my channel's not even going to be a thing. Um in two months so we'll find out but to answer your question not for now second question uh will you ever build your own lego star wars mocks i don't think so because i don't have a lego store near me the nearest lego store to me is six hours away and that's a long drive and i'm not gonna buy lego pieces online because if I forget to buy a piece or something, then boom, I had to wait even longer, you know. And shipping, like, with Lego.com for a pick a, <clears throat> for pick a brick, excuse me, um, it takes, like, 18 days for me. I don't know why. It just, it does. It's, okay, it's probably not that bad. It, it, it's pretty long, though. Um, so, probably not, but maybe someday. Maybe someday. If they build a Lego store here, yes. Even though that would probably get very expensive. Our last question comes from Ace Gamer Studios. He says, do you think we will get Jedi Fallen Order sets next year? I sure hope so, because my gosh, I've been playing the crap out of this game, and it is amazing, and I love it. Like, if you don't have Jedi Fallen Order, you need to get it, like, right now. It is absolutely amazing. The story is good. Um, the gameplay is so much fun. There's so much to do and see, and just there's a ton of Easter eggs and reference, and... It's a little challenging, like, I think so, but maybe I'm just bad at video games, but, um, you know, so definitely get it, but that's off topic, that's not even really the question, um, the real question is, do you think we'll get Lego sets? I hope so, though, because that would be fun to see, um, but, you know, it took, like, how many years was it, like, one or two to get a set for Battlefront, and it didn't even call it a Battlefront set, um, and so... Hopefully we get some sets that are actually themed around Fallen Order and have named characters and uh, is accurate and all that stuff and I would definitely buy them. So yes, but that's going to do it for today's video so please remember to leave a comment down below if you want to be featured uh, in my next video. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you're new around here, you know all that good jazz. Have a fantastic day, and I will catch you in the next video. So, goodbye.